All right, so Fitbit just announced the Fitbit Blaze. It's gonna be $199 on sale in May onto the other stuff. So the advances are really in fitness. It's gonna automatically track activities. It can uh, supposedly detect when you're, say, playing basketball versus playing tennis versus going for a run or riding a bike. So that's gonna be cool because it's, according, if it works, it's not going to require the user, the wearer, to uh, hit a button to say, I'm gonna start riding a bike now. It will automatically detect that and track you throughout the day. Speaking of days, five days and nights, they say a battery life so that you can wear it not only during the day, but at night. And the advantage there, Fitbit says, is that it can detect your resting heart rate while you sleep. You can set an alarm, that'll go off. Uh, it's still unclear how that alarm wakes you. They call that a silent alarm. So I'm not sure if it's a tactile, sort of it, it vibrates on your wrist or not. The major drawback to this for 199 is that it's called a, a smart fitness watch and not a smart watch straight out because you can't do things that are pretty standard in smart watches like send text for instance. There's not going to be a built-in keyboard or anything like that. You can accept or decline calls that are to your smartphone uh, and uh, you'll get a notification that you've received a text um, but it's a little unclear whether you're going to be able to read that text from the watch itself. Um, so $199 on sale in May. What do you think?